all right so when i crossed 6000 plus youtube subscribers on this channel i dropped a message in our telegram community that what will you love my next video to be about and then i got a couple of requests but then i'm going to start with this and um it was this was about how to know the right keywords to type when searching for resources how to know the right keywords to to type when searching for resources okay now and that is what this video is going to be about in this video because i've gotten this request to a couple of times so in this video i'm going to show you um, how to search for resources as a designer so for example i got a request on the uh, telegram community recently and that is um someone asking how can i make this boss right he said how can he make this particular um, arrow meanwhile this arrow was actually um downloaded it wasn't this is not customized right the person who used this arrow here didn't customize this arrow so i'm going to show you using this as an example how to download resources from the internet for your design um projects so quickly i'm going to just go to chrome i'm going to go to i'll go to chrome and then from here i think the first thing i'm going to do is to first um show you like just give you an hint on how to search for resources so for example now let's assume i need that particular arrow it's quite simple now if you look at it that arrow is not it's not a um it's not it's like an abstract shape like it's not a solid shape like it doesn't have a name i mean it is not a straight line so it's like it was drawn with hand because if you look at it you will see that it looks creative and it's almost like this was drawn so and that is where the keyword my keyword here is going to be hand drawn hand drawn um arrow arrow png because i i want i want it to give me either in black and white or even with transparent background and don't arrow png free download now this is very important because there are many of them that are actually paid that are actually premium so don't forget to always add your free download now one thing i like to tell people when uh, about searching for resources is that be as literal as possible be as literal as possible if you want to search for a car that has another car on it don't look for a special grammar just just go to google and, uh, and you can search for a car with another car on it png free download that is just an example but you get my point be as literal as possible be as literal as possible not just google in fact because there are some other png sites that i i, I can also recommend you can check our telegram community i will drop a I, I think i've done that before yeah i've done that just check the telegram community and scroll up to um one of the first few messages you will see a list of sites i drawed for different resources that is very very important so ensure you do that go and check the group the telegram community if you are not in there just check the description box of this video you will see the link to join the community right then when you join go scroll up and go and go and look for it's a long list of sites um linked um websites where you can download different resources they were grouped so um but png find is one that uh, that actually just came to mind and then png site is a, is a website website where you can get free png images so ev most of these maybe not everyone but most of these sites also have search engines where you can actually search um search for the kind of can you see this this is Andron red circle i have this particular one on my phone Andron red circle so there are a lot of amazing resources here png fire look at it can you see even without searching they're already showing me very very amazing look at this look at very very amazing so you can um check some of this site to look at money you can check some of this silence flare you will see amazing ones but then let's assume that the resource i'm trying to look for or the resources i'm trying to get are not i can't find them here look at this car i'm not uh, i'm not here what i can do is that i can make use of the search engine wow immediately i saw this guy i feel like using it to create a design let me let me know in the comment section if you want me to create a, a design with this car 
I just love the fact that I just love how realistic the shadows are. Let me download this. So let me know in the comment section if you want me to create a tutorial, a, a design using this cast, and then drop the tutorial. Um, let me know. So, but then for now, let me just download it because I feel like it's going to come in handy. Yeah. This one should not waste our time. Oh. All right. You see how easy it is to download. So I've downloaded it already. And then, um, I believe the quality should be high. I think the quality, yeah, the quality is, is fair. It's fair enough. So, um, let me know in the comments. The bo is actually transparent. Uh, let me show you from my gallery. Um, it's actually um, transparent. So can you see the background is transparent? So um, that is th that. That just by the way, actually. But let me know in the comment section if you want a design. If, if you want me to create a design using it, this is another resource. Can you see? Oh come on! This is also amazing. You can just put um, whatever you want to use on the screen. You can put it on the background. I love the shadows too. Can you see I'm already downloading resources, like amazing resources. So it's actually um it's this simple, but then like I said, if you are looking for a particular resource or resources that are not um that are not on their own page, can you see they are showing me uh, related ones here now? So let's as want to get a resource that is not on their own page. One thing I can do is to just use the search engine. And like I said, just like um, Google to be as literal as possible. Now, even if they do not get it, many times they will show you related, like it will pick what you are trying to say and at like produce related results. For example, now let's say I want and drawn circle um, and draw and or and crafted, but then I like to use and drawn that's what i've been using so andron um andron circle or let me say andron arrow since that is what i want to use as example but it applies to every other resources though andron arrow um f uh, png you know this this is png find and in this website all the pngs here are free they're actually free so there is no point saying free download in this website in this particular website so we have three pngs about so they actually got yeah and drawn and drawn arrow png so they got um three results from here but actually they would have given me uh more results so let me just use and drawn arrow yeah adibian is gogu and that is why i recommend gogu because gogu is actually the best why because from gogu gogu can recommend this website because um gogu is actually the uh, i think that's the biggest search engine between google or youtube so that is why i recommend it like i just instead of just coming to this um website uh, directly i would recommend that you just go to google or go to your chrome or whatever browser you are using and just search for android like i just searched for android arrow png free download then from there you can click on images and then you will see them recommending different websites can you see and you have a lot of options to pick from look at this is clean png another website where you can get free pngs so um i think i would recommend actually i would recommend um google like use google instead of going to the website directly this is png item another amazing website where i download my resources from yes google leads me there so there are these amazing resources like different kind of arrows different types of arrows you can always explore can you see look at the kind of the arrow that the guy was asking for so we have um look at it i can decide to download this i can decide to okay let's say for example now in this particular scenario where you know there are some websites where you can access these um resources for free so what you just have to do is for example now this one is in black and white and that is the advantage of also searching for the png many times they will give you in black and white version so i can just click on this and then download image i mean in a situation whereby the resource is probably maybe it leads me to free pick and you know free pick has premium resources and it has free resources so what i can do is that instead of just going to the website by clicking on visit i will just stay here and then i will say i will download the image now the problem with this the i think the downside to this is the fact that the quality will be low but at the same time you are looking for an arrow this is not a major element you are still going to reduce the size of this element so then i've done that it now i can come to my pixel lab i can import it 
whatever tool you are using it doesn't really matter so uh, i can come to my pixel lab then i can import this and then i can mark it and then i can go to erase color erase color then erase it and then i can crop out the one i want can you see that is the advantage let me change the background color so that you will see what i'm doing and see that the background has actually been re uh, removed can you see so to remove some of these white patches that are still left see the same thing i'll just go to erase color and then i will increase the increase my tolerance and then yes their quality will be low though but at least let me change the color to white so that i can look at it can you see yes so the only downside is that the quality will be low but then i've still gotten what i'm looking for and then we have this so that is how to download i think uh, that is the question um the amazing person asked um i think what the person requested for which i'm very sure to a lot of you would have found it very useful he said um how to know the right keywords to step when searching for resources so to actually get the right keyword just it depends on what you are looking for now for example now this particular one that he showed me i studied it you can just look at it okay this is an arrow at least you saw an arrow here there. this is an arrow then you see that okay it looks creative in fact even if android does not come to your mind you can just use creative arrow if i use creative arrow is it going to give me at least similar recommendations Let, let's see it since this is a practical um session creative arrow creative arrows png so let me change let me remove the a that was a mistake creative arrows png can you see can you see what i'm saying right can you see what i'm saying so i'll say be as literal as possible that's just the keyword like that's just the point when you are searching for resources if you are looking for a resource with maybe um you are looking for a black man holding carrying a car be as literal as possible I, one site i use very well especially when i'm looking for high quality images high quality stock photos is that i go to freepick.com and on freepick.com i am as literal as possible if i'm looking for a if i'm looking for a lady sitting on a car for example I, i'm or maybe a black lady or an african lady a black lady sitting on a car just be you you know the the idea is that you actually know what you want but you don't know how to search for it it means if you know what you want that means there is a word that accompanies what you want in your mind just type it out type it out these things are becoming more intelligent day after day a black lady um sitting on a red car even if they do not have that exact result they will show you something similar that you can always use that you can always um use okay sit a black lady sitting on a red car so i cannot begin to explore and just explore and just explore so uh, they do not have and look at it now i think they, they've given me one so they may not give you exactly what you want but at least something close to it you will get something close to it this one is white car you will get something close to what you want that's the that's the especially free pick i i can say a lot about free, free pick because i use free pick a lot so there's some other side that are not not that that their search engine has not are not as intelligent as free pick as google so if you're having problem with those so i just come to google and then search for what you are looking for so the the um the major point i mentioned is that be as literal as possible right don't start looking for a grammar to use for it to give you just be as literal as possible with it even if what you are looking for is two ends see no matter how wide it is be as literal as possible and i believe um i've been able to help somebody now if this video has helped you in any way don't forget to share this video with at least somebody and don't forget to hit the like button hit the subscribe button and then drop a comment if you find this video very very helpful yes if you do not find it helpful let me know in the comments too <laughs> i will see you in my next video